I need everybody. Come on over. Now, I need this team. You are going to be on the meatball. Okay? So, Mr. Margolis is a really good teacher. I know a lot of people whose favorite class is P.E. because of Mr. Margolis. When the kids get out of the car or off the bus, they tell you, Mr. Adam, I got P.E. today. Mr. Adam, I get to go see Mr. Margolis today. I say no to the meatball, and I say no to the meatball. And now I present to you, ladies and gentlemen, my spaghetti with Adam. <laughs> He always makes us laugh because he's super funny. And he makes every game fun. Already! Go! I like it, it's fun. He makes the warm up like a game and then you go to the actual exercise. And it's active and we're getting our bodies healthier. Good job! Nice, be careful, keep your personal space! Nice, do it again! Great job! I lucked into this position 26 years ago because my cooperating teacher, Jamie Wright, left right after my student teaching experience and I was hired. And that was the first time in 22 years between he and the former legend, Mr. DeSabatino, Mr. D, that you get an opportunity to teach in your hometown. Caden, <coughs> what kind of space do we call that? The Personal space. Mr. Margolis builds relationships first. He makes students want to be in his classroom. He believes in total participation, not just the kids, but I can't walk into that room without him, you know, talking me into enjoying the activity with the students. Everyone, I want you to lay all the way back. My main motivation helps students feel more confident in their bodies. Rocket! Soldier! The goal is to let the students feel how successful they can be if placed in the right environment and I want them to be confident in the skill set that they have, that they can participate in anything and be lifelong movers. He doesn't want us to give up on challenges that might seem hard. And his PE class isn't about like winning or anything like that. It's about developing skill and teamwork. We're gonna pretend this black line is a vein or artery. So it's heart over to the Lungs. back over to the heart. And now I deliver this oxygen where? For a couple weeks or so in the school year, we do something about the body. And it's very sciencey, and I really like that. So we like ran around in the lines and like would go to the first side of the heart, go to the lungs, go to the other side of the heart, pick up a bing bag, which is the oxygen. Then we go through the lines and we drop it off at one of the chairs, which is like the brain, arms, and legs. I really feel that the best lessons in any classroom are when kids are up and doing something. I'm happy to tie in when I can, math or reading or any other subject that I can tie into what we're doing. I'm just blessed to, to teach in an environment where they can do that every day. To get the award really just makes me feel grateful. Grateful for the support system that Charles County Public Schools has put in place. I couldn't be more thankful for my administration, my content specialists that just have given me so many wonderful opportunities. It's definitely a, an award that goes to everyone in our school. When you leave this class, how do you feel afterwards? Happy. I feel very, like, confident. He's a great teacher. I think he's taught me a lot. This is more than a job. You know, Mr. Margolis is well known in the community. He's a wonderful person. He makes the kids want to be here. Grab that meatball. Put it on the plate. We are blessed to have Mr. Margolis at Mitchell.